though. Could you maybe like walk us through like that product experience and what it's like for both sides? The product experience on apartment list? Yeah. 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 So um, on the renter side, apartment uh, renters who are looking for a home will typically start by just a- answering a few questions about them. So what, how many bedrooms are you looking for? What amenities are important to you? And most importantly, what is most important to you? And the options are staying within my budget, staying in the location that I want, getting all of the amenities. And so that really tells us a lot about the renter. Then where we land them, and this is where um, we get kind of a ton of praise from our renters is on actually not a search page, but a categories experience. And so we'll say this matches everything you want. Maybe there's only three that have everything you want. If you were to commute a little bit farther, but you want all your amenities, here's where you go. Or if you wanted to pay a little bit more, maybe this is where you could get. And so we really help people, renters make those trade-offs and around what's important to them in order to um, help them find a home that they love, which is our goal. So that um, is the renter experience. Typically then they will go through, go click a category. Maybe they want to start with the things that match everything. They will decide whether they like love or don't like. Um, each of those properties, and then we'll encourage them to reach out to the properties that they are interested in. And at that point, the leasing agent will contact them. The way that apartment list makes money is based on leases that are signed. And so properties, what properties love is that we make money only when they make money rather than just every month or based on one, a phone number or based on something else. And so on the property side, their experience is actually primarily with our sales people, not with our product. Um, they experience, we we push our information into the systems that they already use. So we'll push, if a renter contacts them, it will show up as a tour booking. It will show up as um, as an email. It will show up as in their system with, with information that we have already collected about the renter and then they can follow up. Um, and so they sort of go through that third-party system and then they talk to our sales agents and our customer success agents around their needs, around um, how we're serving them and how we could kind of adjust to serve them better. So that's kind of, I think, the best summary of how both sides of the marketplace interact.